Hey friends, this is Atif Hope, you're well and welcome to the new update on Bitcoin. As in my earlier videos, I was showing you that Bitcoin was testing the support of the super trend indicator on a seven day time frame chart. And this was the video when I was showing you that whenever Bitcoin breaks down this support, this green line, uh, let me just show you on the live chart, this green line, then Bitcoin goes in a very long term bearish market like uh, it was happening here. You can see after breaking it down, it entered in a very long term bear market. And before that, by the way, it was happened uh, here as well. After the breakdown, it entered in the long term bear market. And same as like that, it was about to break down this time as well. We had a long spike beyond this part where the price and did not break it down. If we take a look at the stochastic oscillator, then you can see that stochastic is showing a bullish divergence as it is forming higher low. At the same time, the price line is forming lower low, and therefore the price and followed this signal did not break down. This support the super trend and in today's video we will analyze this move and i would also like to show you the bollinger bands indicator as well you can see right now the price line is testing the support of the lower bands of the bollinger bands again and the amount of the bollinger band is now getting expanded but before starting this analysis if you are not subscribed to my channel then do subscribe and for more trading signals you can also join me and support me as a youtube member or as a patreon member because there i'm sharing different trading signals for you and you can find a link to join me there in the video description I've shared. And if you would like to see how my trading signal worked, then I've also shared the link for the trading signal report for the previous month of July 2024 in the video description. You just need to open that report. And if you would like to check or verify any trading signal, like there's a trade setup for people, you just need to click on the link for the trade setup and it will take you to the trading view chart. And on this chart, you can see when I shared this signal, like this trade setup I shared on 14th of July 2024. And you can also watch the complete trade setup as well. Like this was the buying zone and the sell target zone and the stop loss. And in order to see how the price line moved after sharing this signal, you need to click this button. And after that, it will show you how the price line moved up from the buying zone and rallied to the sell target zone. And this was a very massive pump, by the way. Now, let me to take you to the live chart of Bitcoin. And first of all, let me to show you this super trend indicator on the seven days time frame chart. You can see whenever Bitcoin breaks out this super trend indicator and it turns green, then Bitcoin starts a very, very massive and long term bull run like it was happening here. Uh, by the way, this bull run was started here in the month of April 2019. But after that, we had a COVID crash in the month of March 2020. But uh, it immediately recovered back. And you can see that this bull run was again begun. And that was a very long term bull run. It was also happened here as well. Uh, after the breakout from the month of August 2015 up till uh, December 2017, this bull run was uh, happening and after that we broke down uh this super trend indicator and after that bitcoin entered in a long-term bear market this time you can see it was again again trying to uh break down this support the super trend you can see that uh this bull market was begun here when it was turned green in the month of january 2023 you can see that several times the price and moved very close to the support but did not test the support of the super trend but this time it was testing the support but at the same time there is also a bullish divergence flash you can see that the price end uh, was dropping down and it was forming lower low. But at the same time, you can see that stochastic was forming higher low than the previous one. This was the bullish divergence signal. Therefore, the price end did not break down this support. And now here, by the way, Bitcoin has found another downtrend line resistance as well. And in, in order to continue this rally, we will need to break on this resistance. Now, if we take a look at the Bollinger Bands indicator and the Bollinger Bands width indicator, you can see that Bollinger Bands is now expanding. Previously, it was squeezed. And when before that, it was squeezed here. And before the expansion, the price and tested the support of the lower bands of the Bollinger Bands. And then Bollinger Bands get, uh, was expanded and we had a very, very nice rally. It was also happened here as well. When it was squeezed here, we tested the support. And after that, the mouth of the Bollinger Bands uh, was expanded. And then we saw a very, very massive rally this time. When it was squeezed here, the price and again dropped down at the support. And this time it was trying to break out this resistance. In fact, for a while, we broke out this resistance. Uh, that is, by, by the way, a basis of the Bollinger Bands, the, this blue line that was breaking as a resistance. For a while, we broke it out, but without uh, hitting the upper bands of the uh, Bollinger Bands, price and again dropped down. And this time you can see that Bollinger Bands is getting expanded. At the same time, if we take a look at the Bollinger Bands width indicator, and you can see it is continuously moving to the outside. And if we take a look at the previous history of Bollinger Bands width indicator, then we can see that whenever this blue line, after hitting the support of the Bollinger Band width indicator, starts moving to the outside, the price and follows 
the movement of this blue line. You can see it was happened here when this blue line started moving to the upside. The price and also started to rally to the upside. It was also happened here as well. But this time you can see when this blue line was turning up and moving up at the same time the price line uh, was moving down and testing the support of the Bollinger Bands, the lower bands of the Bollinger Bands. Therefore, I was telling you that this drop can be short term. And after that, we may see a bounce from here. So far, the price line is still moving at the support of this uh, the lower bands of the Bollinger Bands. But if it will be moved up, then it can hit the resistance, this basis, this blue line of the Bollinger Bands. Uh, that is this time. By the way, you can watch the value of uh, this blue line over here. Uh, this time it is at $64,666. And if the price then breaks out this level, then we can expect another move to the outside to the upper bands of the Bollinger Bands. At this time, the upper bands of the Bollinger Bands is at $73,000. By the way, on the monthly time frame chart, Bitcoin has also formed a very huge and massive Elliott wave structure and also forming a very massive cup and handle pattern as well. For that, I have posted separate videos. You can also watch those videos as well. So this was the update so far. I hope that you've liked the analysis. Then do hit the like and do subscribe to the channel as well. And for more trading signals, you can also join me and support me as a YouTube member or as a Patreon member because there I'm sharing different trading signals for you. And you can find a link to join me there in the video's description I've shared. Take care. Goodbye.